Hello, baby gangsters. This is Calvin, also known as Omer, and this is my first ever playthrough of Pokemon Violet, the Teal Mask. How's our team doing? Our team's doing okay. We put a Quagby on the team. Uh, <laughs> probably, like, <laughs> the most redundant thing I think I've ever done in a Pokemon game. But we've done it. We can't deny it. It's happened. We have we have put a Quagwe on the team, and we should feel ashamed. Uh, really, like, the reason I put Quagwe on the team was just, like, I... Oh, there's, like, a duck Pokemon. What the hell? Wait, there's, like, a duck Pokemon. Is that in this... Is that in this cave? No, it's down below. There's a duck po... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Break my legs. Wait, we also have the idea we could put Lucario on the team at any moment as well if we needed to. What's the duck Pokemon? Oh, Chunky Belly! Wait, is it gonna turn into that weird duck? What's it gonna turn into? What's it gonna turn into? That's that's my problem. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's always like, wow, that Pokemon looks so cool. What's it gonna turn into? We just save some quick balls for the next DLC. Actually, someone made a suggestion that we we have a mixture of our old team and our new team now. It strengthens its body and by diving into the depths of ponds, swimming around while uh, looking for bog uh, bog moss to eat. It's a cool looking Pokemon. Uh, I will give Duckling a name. I think we're gonna call him um, Uggo for like ugly Duckling, but like in a cute way, like you know, a cute Ugg way, you know. Sent to the boxes. So I actually like the idea of for now, since we're gonna be switching up teams for the DLC as well. I think it might be a fun idea to now kind of work out what our team is going to be for the next while with a mixture of our old team and our new team. And we're going to make a rule that it has to be three from this team and three from the other team. Uh, so, we ca we, so we're not just neglecting one side of the team or not. And the great thing is, is like I have an affinity towards both sides now. So, for example, I want to keep Shadow Rob because it's been so powerful. The disguise thing is really, really good. I think it's just a good idea to keep the disguise thing. Uh, Ladybird also, I think, is a really good Pokemon. The, the dark fire moves works really well together. Uh, if I'm thinking of the other Pokemon I want to keep out of all these Pokemon, I think maybe... See, I think keeping Dale is a good idea. Sonny Boy going back on the team, I don't know how you guys... Wait, maybe... Yeah, Sonny, Sonny Boy should go back on the team. So Sonny Boy's here. Uh, then the ones we're taking off the team, uh, Summer. Uh, Quagwee, of course. Uh, Harpo did really good for us, and I, I thank Harpo for everything he's ever done. Um, and I don't want to be like, oh, like, yeah, get off the team now, you've done everything. But now, now we're getting to a higher level state, I feel like it makes sense to do this. So this is the three, so, okay. Uh, wait, we're supposed to keep three off the off the team, so who are we keeping on? Shadow Realm, Harpo, Sh Shadow Realm, Ladybird, and... Well, let's see who we're going to put on from the other team. So we're putting on Sonny Boy, I think Fival. No, because we don't have to have a fairy type as well on the team, because that would be kind of strange. Kubo, for sure, we'll put Kubo on the team. Kubo's very good. Um... So that's two from the other team. What other Pokemon from that team? So I think like either like Fival or we could put on Silver and have a Rock type. But then again, I don't I don't know how much how bene much of a benefit that's going to be. Um, Sora, Sora. I think Sora, because then we have a Dragon. But then again, we have a yeah Dragon Flying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. And then from the new team, we need one more Pokemon from the new team, and it could be Harpo. Because then, but then again, we have a Fighting type already. We have a Bug type already. Uh, we could put a normal type on. Um, we could. So let's see. Let's see. Well, I wonder. Hold up a second. I wonder. Because uh, we don't have to have these three Pokemon on here. Like, if we, we could take... I don't I don't want to... Like, if we took Shadow Realm off, that I feel like we'd have to put Toto back on. And I like to, I love Toto. He's our most powerful thing we have. But I, I kind of like Shadow Realm as well. And I feel like Shadow Realm's been working their arse off. So I think they deserve to be in this DLC for the last bit. Like most Pokemon do with this team. Um, Quagwee? 
Quagly the water ground boy. Um, Snorlax, maybe I'll go. Glamora, Mises. Glamora's not on our team. We cannot act like Glamora's on our team. Um, okay, let's figure this out. Let's figure this out. Because our team, as it was, was pretty freaking great. Like, the, the Harpo with Poliwrath is really good. So I wonder if we put Harpo on and take Sora off. For now. So we take Sora off, put on Harpo. But then the Brick Break is so good as a fighting move and a bug move. Like, he's so good that way. But then we can just have him as a pure water type. Yeah, no. Hold on a second here. Uh, if we put on Sora, have the dragon flying, have the water move if we need it. We could just put Fival on the team and have an electric fairy type as well. But I feel like that defeats the purpose of having Shadow Realm on the team. Because we want to cover our bases. You know, we want to cover our bases. Dale, having being grass poison, is probably better than having Sonny Boy, who is just grass. <laughs> right? I feel like that's such a way better way of covering our ground. For now, anyway? Yeah. I don't know, man. I feel like it's a way better way of covering our ground. You know? Uh, as much as I love Sonny Boy. Like, Sonny Boy doesn't need to be destroyed constantly in the DLC. Which is what would probably happen. So then we need one more Pokemon if we're mixing both of the teams together. Because now they're like similar levels. So we have the three from the new team. Our Ladybird, Shadow Realm, and Dale. And the old team, it's Kubo, Sora, and... See, these are these don't count as being from the, 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 the team before. So we could put Silver on. And have a Rock type. I mean, I'm not against that. Or we could put Toto on as well and have like... But we already have Fire and Ghost. We could put Fival on and have like an Electric Pokemon. Because that is, it has been the one thing that's kind of been missing on our team. is an Electric style Pokemon. Yeah, I, I think I think we'll go with that. So I think we have a, some ground cover. We have fire and dark. We have ghost and fairy. We have poison and grass. Fighting and bug. Flying and dragon and water if we need it. And then electric and fairy. As again. So if we need it. I think it's a good team. Now we could easily just like put Toto on the team. And put him in Ladybird's position. And I think we might do that maybe next DLC, but for now, I think Ladybird has been really good to us as well. I know I'm thinking of this in, like, such a weird fashion. But that's the team we're going with, guys, for now. And then in the deals next DLC, what we're going to do is we're going to catch two... We're going we're gonna to have a Pokemon team. We're going to catch all new Pokemon again. But we're going to have a team of Pokemon that... Um, how do I say it? We're going to have a team of Pokemon... We're looking for here. Yeah, a team of Pokemon that have like like two from the new DLC, two from this DLC, and then two from the base game. In the end, I guess the end. That's the end game bosses, end game thing. So people actually told me to go back. Oh, wait, we'll go look at it in a second. By the way, I have a different mic setup today, so I hope that. Uh, oh, I used to say there again. I hope that you guys, it sounds okay. If it doesn't sound okay, let me know, and we'll change things again. You really want me to be here, do you? Don't worry, it'll be fine. Key, what's this all about, really? I know you must be scared, Ogre Pond, but I did my best. So just trust me and come with me, okay? I say trust him. He's actually a good... He's a good kid. He's a good kid, Ogre Pond. He is. And he likes you a lot, so... Trust him. Dale is fairly on the level, though, I suppose. So what are you guys going to do, huh? What, what's happening now? If you say anything to him, we're going to kill you. That's the that's the deal. So that's... Uh, Ogre Pond. Is actually real? Let's trust Kieran. So this is the Ogre of the Oni Mountain. This is the true face of Ogre Pond, who we sorely wronged. For far too long, we told tales of casting you as a villain here in Kitakami. We all owe you a great apology. Yeah, Ogre Paul, look at this! Hey, what's going on? Why the sudden ab about face? What? 
Kieran's been running around the whole village telling everyone the true story of what happened. I was worried he stirred up a lot of resentment, so I told him to stop, but... We're so sorry, dear ogre. Ogapon's so cute. He is cute. Seems I was wrong to worry too much. Who knew that Kiki had it in him? Especially since Yuji hates uh, talking to people. From now on, you can come to the village whenever you want. And you don't need to hide your face when you do. Ponyo. Three masks were kept at Kitakami Hall, rightfully belong to you all. If you manage to get them back for those three villains, please feel welcome to keep them. We got the masks back, so we managed to clear Ogapon's name. Now that's what I call a happy ending. One last thing to do, let's escort Ogrepon back to his home. Wait, was that the ending? I can't imagine that we're gonna not have another battle. You know what I mean? Can't imagine that there's not gonna be like at least one more battle in this game. Can't imagine. I can't imagine there's not gonna be one more battle. It would be very confusing if there was- Wait, where does he live again? Up this way, isn't it? Oh wait, do we have to go this way? No, I think it's this way, isn't it? Because he- this way he was hiding. Yeah, yeah, I think it's this way. So this was, um... A, a very good DLC, but I don't think it's over yet. I- I-, I it's hard- it's hard for me to believe that it would be over now. Um... Yeah, I'm looking at our team now. I actually think our team is a good mix now. It's a good mix. It's a good mix of our original Pokemon and our new Pokemon. It feels good to end a DLC this way, you know, kind of bringing back our old uh, Pokemon. And I can't wait to see old Pokemon in the new DLC as well. Oh yeah, Jesus. Okay, before we do anything. Um, hold on a second. Someone said I can like... No, wrong thing. Sorry. Someone said I can dash with the with the with with Maridon. Is this true? Oh my god, there's a Vulpix on the, the bridge. We we had dreams of having a Vulpix at one point in this team. They were dashed. Uh, <laughs> when he evolved. Uh, let's see. Someone said go over here and look at the trainer with the with these things here. Why do they want me to look at this trainer? The hair? What's your name? Perrin. Is this, uh, like, is this descendant of, like, Adamon? Is that what we're looking at here? Is this an descendant of Adamon? That could be the case. That could be, I guess that's what people would, like, look like. That's the only thing I can think of. Um, and they do descendants in these games quite a bit. Like it's not like it's a it's a new occurrence. That's really cool. If that's the case. That's the only one I can think of anyway. Maybe I'm wrong. We can fast travel up here. The the Pokemon up here would not be worth fighting. Is it here? I might not. I don't think. I don't. Th I think the ogre's den is probably probably a different place, isn't it? I feel like I'm I'm going the wrong way. But I, but he was oh no because he was only here because yeah yeah I think it's here. The ogre's den is here. So we go up this way and travel all the way around, right? Or is it this this way? Now let's go this way first. I'm sorry that I'm getting so turned around. The map is so small. <laughs> like, for, I just always get confused on that ridge of the map, like the mountain ridge. I love that they have hoot hoots instead of um rocka uh, rocka whatevers. Squawkabillies, yeah, squawkabillies. I like how they have hootoots. Or not hootoots, noctowls. You guys are getting leftovers at the festival? Guys, the festival's over. Go home. Everyone go home. No, this is not. Yeah, it's not here. I don't think it's here. Oh, I think it is. It is. It is. It is. It is. In the Oni Mountain. Who are we, fi who are we fighting? It's me! Johnny! Your name's Growlet. Oh, you can't just be funny for a minute while I was trying to be funny. 
I'm trying my stand-up routine. Your stand-up routine is calling yourself Johnny. Kind of funny. No, it's it's not funny. Be very rude. Very rude indeed. If I want, like, if I ever want to, like, make myself laugh, I'll say indeed after a sentence. It's not in my actual vocabulary, you know? I guess we can, like, continue to level up our, our Dale as we're going up here. I imagine that the three Pokemon are waiting for us up here. And it would be so cool if he did, like, a six-man, like, battle with the Pokemon. But I don't think that, I, I think that's getting my hopes up too high. I think that's like that's that's not something that's gonna happen. It'd be cool if it did. It'd be really cool, but I don't. I don't. I think. I think. I think at some point, you have to like have proper expectations for the game you're playing. And I'm not saying that like it's not a game that would do that, but like we've never seen that before, or I've never seen it before. A six-man uh, Pokemon battle, like with six Pokemon out in the field at the same time. It'd be insane if they did it. It'd be really cool. I'd love it. I'd be so into it. I'd actually cry. I will cry. No, I probably won't cry. But I'll be very happy. Um, I'll settle for, like, me and Kieran fighting together. You know what I mean? I really feel like they've done a really good job with Carmine's character in this game. Like, I feel like she has had a lot of growth. Um, but also, like, there's no excuse. She's not excusing herself. Which I think is just as cool. I think it's so easy to like build a character up like this, and then have them like, you know, ha and have the like, like I think the worst thing they could have done was had Kieran apologize, and not have us apologize. And I'm glad they did have us apologize. Kieran's apology was a bit weird because it's like, man, it's totally normal to feel a bit left out. It's totally normal to feel that way. Whilst our apology was kind of like the truer one, which is like, hey, you know, we neglected to tell you this stuff. We didn't uh, put faith in your maturity. So yeah, there's there's a difference. There's a difference. The wind is cutting me into the clouds again. Really, it's so weird that we're like, hey, get back into your hole. <laughs> get back into your cave. He's like strutting in. Look, he's strutting in. He's way happier now. Well, here we are. We have to kill those Pokemon, though. Pawn. It's a bit lonely out here, but I guess this place must mean a lot to Ogre Pond. Take care, okay, Ogre Pond? I mean, come and visit us anytime. Cause, like, well, I won't be living here, but. Paul? Hey, you know what? I think I might want to go with you, Wonder. Wait, what? Oh, Kiki. Hey, hold up. If it's not gonna stay here, then I wanna. I want everyone to come with me. Kiki. I know I'm being real selfish, but I wonder, please. That's not selfish to want a Pokemon that you've, like, obsessed over and, like, championed for your whole freaking life. Like, you, you've championed this Pokemon more than anyone has championed a Pokemon. Hey, Kiki. No, no, we're not acting like it's immature for him to want to have a Pokemon that he has been the one for years telling everyone that it's a good Pokemon. I know you really love Ogopon. I really honestly understand. But you have to think of Ogopon's feelings, too. True, that is true, but also, like, it's not immature for him to be like, hey, I'm the one who, like, constantly was like, Ogre Pond is a good dude. I want Ogre Pond to come with me. I want to battle anyway. So let me know once you're ready. Is this the final boss of the game? Is this it? See, it's hard to know, like, uh, like what the final boss of the DLC will be. And in terms of, like, doing the Pokedex, by the way, uh, I want to make it clear that, like, I totally understand people, like, are like, hey, do the 100% do the Pokedex. The issue is, and the issue always is, guys, like, I don't make it, it's not like I'm, I'm, I'm being deceitful or anything, or, like, I'm, 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 you know, skirting your expectations. 
I legit, at, at the start of every Pokemon playthrough, say we're not going to be 100% in the Pokedex. We're not going to be getting all Pokemon in the Pokedex. This is just literally the case. Um, I've said this since the beginning. I've said this all the time. It happened with Legends Arceus too. And now in fairness, the people that are like, hey, you should do the Pokedex. I really like saying you have to do it. It's like, hey, you should do the Pokedex. But I just want the people, the people to know that there's a reason why at the start of every playthrough and through every playthrough, I always say I'm not doing the Pokedex. So at the end of the game, when people are like, you didn't do the 100% Pokedex, people understand, hey, he didn't lie to us. He told us from the beginning. You knew what to expect. Now, with Legends Arceus, I remember I, at the start of the playthrough, I said, I'm not doing the 100% Pokedex. It's not something I find fun to complete the Pokedex. I find, you know, just the casual aspects of Pokemon really fun. Um, and I still have people at the end of it going, why aren't you doing the full Pokedex? And it's like, man, like, if you're upset by me not doing the Pokedex, which, by the way, the people asking for the Pokedex in this playthrough have been very pleasant about it. I just want to make sure they know. The reason I've been saying this is because I do want to let them know. Let's go. You ready to battle? Uh, ready as I'll ever be, Kieran. I'll be honest with you. Ready as I'll, uh, ready as I'll ever be. Whoever wins gets to be Ogrepan's partner. So this is one of those things that we can't lose on purpose, so don't you dare hold back. Yeah, and he doesn't want us to hold back. I, I was thinking, like, is this one of those things that, like, it would be really cool at some stage in Pokemon, in my opinion, to bring back losable battles. Like, that's one opinion I have of this, of Pokemon, for the next Pokemon game. Bring back battles you can lose. I know, that, 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 battles that, like, not even, it's not about the consequences, my man. Who cares about the consequences? But, like, I think in bringing back battles... That I can actually like lose. That that that, that in the end, like like there's the, the, the battle with Carmine earlier. Like we should have lost it. You're not holding back, thank you, but I won't hold back either. Like we should have been able to lose the Carmine battle, in my opinion, a while back. I think that would have been really cool. Like the time when we fought Arvin in the base game, I understand why they wanted us to beat him, but like it would have been so cool if he was like, I beat you. And then halfway down area zero, he's like, do you want to do this again? You know what I mean? That would have been really cool. Uh, we were lucky to have uh, uh, that type of advantage there. Probo Pass. I'm sending out Sora <laughs> because it sounds like it's something like Nose Pass that is a rock type. Maybe it's an evolution of Nose Pass. Yes, it is. Oh my god, that's rotten! <laughs> that's rotten! What the hell? <laughs> that's an abomination! That's an affront to God! <laughs> what is it in its mouth? Is that like a mustache or is it like cold or what is it? <laughs> Why did you catch that, Kieran? Polyrath, yeah, we will switch Pokemon. So it's a water type, so sending out Dale might be a good idea. Yes. Dale! Go, Dale! Send out Polyrath. Polyrath is a cool Pokemon. I'm glad that we have some similar Pokemon together. So if we try Leaf Storm right now. Maybe? If it hits, Belly Drum. Oh, we're actually incredibly lucky. We're incredibly lucky, because it actually might... If, if we can hit this, it's over. Wait. Oh my god, that is such a... Kieran, that's such a good trainer move. That's such a good trainer move. I mean, it's still lost, but that's such a... That's a, I wouldn't even have done that. That's really good. Like, hey, I can use Belly Drum, but I'm also going to make sure he has food to replenish himself. Here's about sending Yamega, I will switch out Pokemon. This is the problem, I think, with fighting a trainer so many times and having those Pokemon. We know what he's got, we know what Pokemon to use now, you know? Ladybird! How do you know Peggy doesn't have the danger? <laughs> That's my favorite King of the Hill joke. Playing Thor style. Bug Buzz could actually end us because it's dark. Yeah, it's actually pretty good against us because it's dark. Wow. Now, is that because it's also flying? 
Yeah, this ain't gonna kill us. It might have crits and it will. Yeah. See, this is why maybe having Toto is better than having this Pokemon, and we might put Toto back on the team. Jesus Christ. Um, this is why I think having Toto is better. Uh, because Toto has the ghost resistance as well as the fire resistance, which means that he has like such a good resistance to a lot of moves, and a lot not a lot of Pokemon can battle against a ghost type. Um, so maybe. Yeah, maybe. Jesus, well done. I would not have liked to gone this whole battle without Kieran knocking out one of my Pokemon, if I'm being honest. Okay, so who's super effective? I guess, yeah, Fival. You you don't understand what this is, Kieran, okay? And I'm sorry, this is Fival. This is Fival. This is Mr. Win every single duel, duel battle for me. Oh my god, what if this actually kills me? It nearly did. Fival is like a beast, though. Look at this. That's, like, not all your health in one go. <laughs> uh, let's see who else we got here now. Who are you going to send next? Glizgore. Glizgore was the, um, the kind of, like, I think Sora. I think Sora comes out next. Oh, that's an evolution of the other one we fought. So we could try uh, Surf. Rock Tomb is going to kill me because of the flying. Oh, it actually didn't. But I think this is like an Earth or Ground type. I could be wrong, though. It's a really weird type uh, difference. Nice. So we could die right now. So maybe I, I heal up. <laughs> See, the thing is, like, there's, there's an element of, like, hey, I don't mind if Kira knocks out my Pokemon, but I feel like it's also insulting to him if we, like hold back a little bit, you know what I mean? I still have to find it so funny. It doesn't matter how strong my opponent is. I gotta face him head on. Get me, get him with your wings. Um, wait, what? No, 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 no. Kieran. No. Um. That was, you should have used rock to me, would have, because then you would have destroyed me next turn. Um, I remember, like, when I finished Legends Arceus, and people were like, you use someone said, you use full restores, that's, that's cheating. And I remember just being like, what? <laughs> what is happening? Apparently, some people see using uh, restorative items as cheating. I didn't know this until, like, I, like, got into the Pokemon series. It's not over yet. I'm tired of losing. You don't have to lose. Sent out Diplin. Digimon, 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 Digimon. I love Digimon. I've never seen Digimon or even played it, but I think it's a cool thing. Anti-establishment, am I right, guys? I like some. Like I like how did my favorite thing with Digimon and legit. This is my favorite thing about Digimon is how passionate the fan base is. The fan base like like will will like if you go if you go and post a thing thing on Twitter saying which is better, Pokemon or Digimon? Digimon people will literally like you know find your house. <laughs> They're like here, Digimon's the greatest thing ever made. And in fairness, like you know I'm very passionate when it comes to them. People go like which is better, Yu-Gi-Oh or Pokemon? And like for me guys, I love Pokemon. But if you put Yu-Gi-Oh against anything, you know? Calvin, if you could choose between Yu-Gi-Oh and going and you're, you, you know, having an education, you know, Yu-Gi-Oh is going to be up there. Yu-Gi-Oh is important to me. Yu-Gi-Oh taught me about how, how to, Yu-Gi-Oh taught me the real life lessons. That if you ever have a pharaoh in your, in your bedroom. I feel really bad for Kieran, though, man. Figures. No, it doesn't figure, man. What happened was here, and this is this, this thing here, you knew, I wasn't going to change my team. You should have, like, caught some more Pokemon that were going to destroy me. Do you ever hear Garchomp? I'd let you use Garchomp. This can't be the final boss either, is it? I'd say there's probably another thing coming. I knew I couldn't win. But you just couldn't give up. Oh, our buddy. Our buddy. No, it's okay, buddy. It's okay. I'm sorry. Oh 
Oh, Kiki. Pond? Pond's like, I don't, Ogre Pond's like, I don't even know what's happening. Like, it's time for you to catch Ogre Pond, Wonder. You wanna catch me? So do we catch him in a battle sense, or do we just get to catch him automatically? Prove yourself to Ogre Pond? So this might be the final battle. Wait, do, do we heal our Pokemon up? Oh my god, that's... This game needs to... Cab. <laughs> like, sometimes they're too generous. You know what I mean with this stuff? Sometimes they're like not generous enough, sometimes they're too generous. Let's go. Let's go. I wish I could get uh, Kieran's boots. His high tops. Oh, does it change its type every time it puts on a different mask? <gasps> That's so sick. Oh my god, it's so sick. He's gonna terrorize as well, I wonder. A terrorization would actually be very good for us, actually. Yep, this is gonna be fantastic for us. Uh, because... Oh my god, that's the coolest terrorization I've ever seen in my life! This is gonna be really good for us because we can actually, uh, know when to catch it. It's terrorized this mask, so this is what Ogre Pond's really capable of. It's the terrorization of the mask is insane. Is insane. Um, so I guess like we we do we'll, what we might do is we'll do charm. So is it still a grass? I don't think is it still a grass type or is it fire now? Because now it's setting up grassy terrain. Um, because I can like yeah. Let's let's let, let Ogre Pond's attack go down a bit. Let's do uh, Shadow Claw just a bit. Ice, Ivy, so it is still a grass type, but it's probably terrorized into fire because of the mask. Disguise, it's the, this is the most OP thing in the world, guys, disguise. It's so OP. Oh my God, the damage actually. Wait, what? Oh, oh, cause of grassy terrain? Ivy Cudgel is a really cool name for a move. Yeah. Nice. You really are a good one, or I'm no match. No, buddy, buddy. Literally, like, like you make two changes to your team, and I'm effed up. You know what I mean? This is the thing that, like, like I, I, I adore Kieran to pieces. You make a few changes to your team, like I, like ever, like you guys. Hey guys, vouch for you and talk to Kieran in the comments, right? Right? If Kieran ever sees this, right? If he, if he's passing by my channel. Right, here's the thing, here. How many times did I just have like, like, did all of my, my losing moments in Pokemon just come from me legit just having a, a team that wasn't up to scratch? Or having Sonny Boy on the team, you know what I mean? Yeah, we're gonna lose here. That's fine though. I wonder who do we swap out for though, like, is, like, he's using grass type moves. So do we switch to Sora? Even though, because his, his Terra Slice form, I think, might be fire. So I, I might try Sora out and try Surf on him. Or no, it'll say. It'll say. Hold on a second. Yeah, it's 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 a terrorized fire type. It's a terrorized fire type. Oh yeah. That's my favorite song. Actually, when I wrote that song, it was 1962. Yeah, that was good. That was good. That was good. And like, but the thing is, like, surf. Ivy, here's the thing, like, it's, it's, it is, like, it, it, we're not, luckily we're not a, 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 yeah, it's not super effective against us, because we're not, like, a, uh, a type that, that, we're not, like, a, a water type. It would be super effective against us if we were actually water, but we're not water. That's really cool, the way it changes like that. So, Ogre Pond, what are you going to be next? Memories of adventuring which you grant Ogre Pond strength. Oh, it's going to turn into water. That's the coolest one, look at that. He looks like it talks like this. Oh, 
grant me strength. So, these aren't going to be effect. Like, here's the thing. I think we should just keep battling. <laughs> uh, the next one is going to be... Oh, yeah, yeah, I'll just keep battling with this, even though, like, it's, like... But he's, he's water, so, like, I don't know how effective it's going to be against the dragon type. Because he's still using, like, his, his other moves. So I think we let Sora keep going until Sora gets knocked out. I think that's the best option. And then we can send out another Pokemon to deal with a water type, you know what I mean? And if we need to, we can, like... Because then it's, it's going to be water, fire, and... What's the next type going to be, I wonder? Is it just going to be grass? Grass, maybe. No, because it's a different type. What if it's, like, ghost? Uh, so I guess we can switch to Dale. It's time for Dale. Um. What is it, Dale? It is a... Dale. It is a legendary. Dale, it is a legendary. You sent me out against a legendary Pokemon. Dale, calm down. Oh, it turns into a poison terrorization? That I should have checked that. That's my bad. But hey, whatever. <laughs> We're here now. Life is here. That's a really cool terrorization, though. Oh my god. It's probably going to destroy us now because we're like uh, pure. Uh, pure. Uh, yeah. We would have had a better chance if we didn't. I thought he was going to terrorize into a grass type. That's my bad for not checking. That's literally my bad. Honestly, probably your guys' fault as well. You know, you should have said something when I was doing that. Like, in fairness. Like, in fairness. You know, you guys were kind of a bit silent. Uh, I'm reading the chat right now. Pretending I'm a streamer. Uh, Thunder! No! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> stop, stop! Wrecking us. Wrecking us now. Jesus Christ! So if Thunder doesn't work this time, we're basically just going to get rocked again. I think it's also that the his moves are being really advanced by the um, the grass type the, the the grass type grassy train. Oh, please be paralyzed for the next move, please. Oh my God, that was just pure luck right there. Come on, use thunder. Yes, okay, we did it. That was pure luck. That was pure luck. That was RNG. We're not gonna take credit for that, Kieran. That was RNG. Don't act like I'm really good. What's next? Yeah, I love those memories of working together. Oh, so it's gonna turn into like a rock type? That's a really cool mask, look at that. Look at that. And it's gonna terrorize into like a rock type now. <laughs> Looks like a big monster. It's actually really cool. Look at that, like in the hair as well coming off it too. It's really cool. Um. Bag. Do we have a max revive? I think we have a max revive for... But I don't think we should use the max revive. I think we should use this item on Sora. Because this Pokemon's about to just absolutely wreck Fival. Oh, Grassy Train again. Grassy, Grassy, Grassy Train. Like, when we come back and do this again... Like, I'll be honest with you guys. When we come back and do this again, I think that we're going to have a way easier time of it than we did now because we're going to know which type. Like, I think, okay, hot take with Pokemon. I think so many of these battles depend on, like, what your first Pokemon is. You know what I mean? I feel like it's literally just that and knowing what you have to use in your first battle. So I guess we send out Sora again because this looks like it's a rock type, doesn't it? I should have checked. I was just so excited. Here we go. This move's called Soyf. Stop that right now. Jesus Christ. Where did you get that from? Polyrath wouldn't have fainted. Just being honest. Oh, brick break. Let's go. <laughs> brick, 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 brick. Kubo, Kubo, Kubo is back. Kubo is back. Brick break. No. <laughs> Cease this right now. Here, look away. Here, look away. Oh, brick break coming. Here's a brick break. What? Not good. Not good. Not good at all. Not good at all. 
Not good at all. Uh, should we just go uh, throw chop again? <laughs> and hope that it goes first? Yeah, it does not go first. Yeah, okay. We lost this one. We'll come back and fight him again. So what type... Like, So then we just send out uh, this boy first anyway to fight this guy. But then again, we don't get to choose which Pokemon we, we, we fight. We, we pick, you know? So now it's all down to Ladybird. Ladybird, it's up to you. Honestly, we should use a Max Revive right now. Like, what's super effective against it other than Brick Break? Dale? Dale, so it is a rock type. Sora got destroyed right away. Kubo got destroyed right away. Honestly? We take the hit, we take the hit. Cause he's gonna go first no matter what. This is insane. This is an insane match. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have to go back and fight him again. Yeah. Wait, we went to the Pokemon Center? That's so far! <laughs> That's such a long way away! Why are we going here? Thank you so much. Okay, let's rearrange our team a bit. For, yeah, let's rearrange our team for this, this battle. So we have... We start off with um, a fire type, right? So I think we put... I, I think that we put our Polyrath back on the team. I think that's that makes more sense. So if we put Harpo back on the team, then Sora. Right? Cause then at least we have like a pure water type on the team. Um Then 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 it switches to a water type. So you want something like Fival there or Dale. Sonny Boy? You know what, Sonny Boy? Get out. You'd go, Sonny Boy. I go, you go, so you're gonna do this. Shadow Realm is cool too, but honestly, like, it's not gonna help us out here. I think Toto is probably a better option than having that on the team. And then we can move you back into here. Kubo is very good to have still because it's a fighting type. It's also gonna turn into a rock type, so we have water for that. We have, yeah, we have water for that. Um, But what's the last place on the team we could have? Um, a normal type? Like Snorlax? But it's not high enough level though, that's the only thing. A rock type? But then the grass moves would destroy it, so we have to f f figure out about that. Something that's not weak to grass moves is probably Toto. And we could use Shadow Ball at the same time. Um, so I actually think putting Dale into the team would actually be more of a benefit. Because then we have two grass types if we need it. Right? Is this is this a weird team for this final battle? Because Ladybird didn't do anything. Ladybird can't do anything. Yeah, I, I think we'll try this team. I think we'll try this. If this doesn't work out as well, it's fine. You know, life goes on. How do we fast travel up here? Uh, it's pity you can't just fast travel to the only. It's up this way, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we'll try our best. We st we start off with a fire type. So, starting off with Polyrath is the best option with Harpo. I think so, anyway. You guys probably, again, know way more than me and probably like, Hey, don't do that. Don't do this. You're probably right. But this is why we have... Uh, we, that's why I'm glad we have, like, a, like, enough varied types. But I think that maybe fighting type would... Fighting, fighting type be... That's the thing that would save us. I think the reason why Sora got trashed so badly was because she was like also she wasn't even nearly. Uh, Sora's not water. You know, Sora's not water. Or um, she's she's flying and dragon. So there's no so like you know that's not the type advantage, just the move that we have. Let's fly over here. Woohoo! Yeah. Look, I'm I'm not I'm not pressed. I'm not upset. You know what I mean? It's not going to upset me. We, we we battle on. 
Actually, putting like more electric Pokemon on the team would be a good idea. Putting five on the team would be a good idea. The only difference is with this battle and also, also, also that terrorization I think is what messed this up as well. I think we would have had some sort of like um, type thing going on there, but because of the terrorization, wait, is this where we go? We didn't. Where about this is this way? It's this way, is it? Because we did the terrorization wrong and we did do it wrong. Like we had a we we did a very bad terrorization. Um, where we made a grass type that would have had resistances to grass moves and turn and would have benefited from sunny day as well and turned that poor thing into a freaking mess. You know what I mean? Not sunny day, grass terrain. But I think having sunny day out there might be a good idea too. Like activating sunny day and then using Maybe and then using Petal Blizzard maybe or something like that. Yeah, for the last Pokemon. So if we can get Sonny Boy out there somehow to use Sunny Day, <laughs> but I don't think it's gonna happen. I don't think so. I, like Sonny Boy is insanely crazy, but like he's not like he's a high level. That's the only thing we could say he's a high level. Who's gonna Terra Slice? I wonder should we Terra Slice Polyrath? To have him like how no, but then Polyrath is gonna be damaged by these grass moves so quickly. So Polyrath is gonna be like gone as soon as possible. So maybe a terrorization of Actually a terrorization maybe of Vival might be a good idea. Okay, Grassy Train gives us it one move. It always gives us one move here. That's that's good damage, but now it's going to use Leaf Erickson. Look at you adapting to Pokemon Sun, and maybe actually, actually actually having Sora out here might be a better idea. <laughs> I think I think you might actually have a, be, be a better idea. Let's use Waterfall. Ivy College is going to destroy us, yeah, because we're Water type. That's that's why I should be thinking about as well. Okay, okay, we should use Hydro Pump then. Still, that's 100 damage. You know what I mean? It's still 100 damage, regardless. Um, let's hope Earth Power goes first. No, it does not. This, no matter what, this Pokemon's gonna go first. That's the that's the difficulty aspect of this. It, like, this battle, in my opinion anyway, isn't difficult if we go first. Does that make sense? Like it is like I don't think it's as difficult if we go first. Uh who's next? She's gonna send out water type after this. So maybe send it, but then like it's fire. Ugh. Sonny boy? Sonny boy. Sonny boy. Sonny boy. Sonny way! Sonny boy, how are you? Uh let's use Petal Blizzard. Oh god. <laughs> He's gonna destroy it. Sonny Boy's gonna die! Sonny boy, yeah! <laughs> Dale, get out there. We should use poison jab. Man, yeah, if this Pokemon didn't get to go first, it would not be, it, we, we, this, this, this be trivial, you know what I mean? Jesus Christ, it's a grass move. Like what the hell do I, what do I have to do? Oh, we're doing worse than last time. Sora was a good. So I I I doubted Sora. Sora was a good addition to the team. Uh, all my Pokemon so far are like destroyed, like they're absolutely destroyed. I blame you guys again. You should have told me. Should have spoiled the game. Let me go first. I'll go first. No, I'll go first this time. It's fine.
Jesus Christ, what, where did my t oh my god. I wish they didn't send you back to the Pokemon Center though, man. Like, Toto, you have to do this whole thing by yourself, okay? It's over. Okay, Toto? It's over. Bottom shelf! Toto, do you remember... Do you remember that night? Do you remember that night? Oh, Grassy Train? Oh, good. Toto, you have to do this whole thing by yourself. It's very sad, but you have to do the whole thing by yourself. Okay. Toto, just like old times. You took me off the team for like nine hours. Semantics, Toto. Semantics. Yeah, there's no way we're beating this Pokemon now. Okay, okay. You know what? I'm gonna, we should just put on our most powerful Pokemon on the team, and that's a crazy concept, but. Okay, I'm gonna be the first to say this. Okay, I know it's horrible. I've said it a million times, but this is the first time I'm actually gonna be like serious about this, and I promise you this. I, I know it's bad, and I know it's upsetting, and I know nobody wants to hear it, and I know nobody nobody wants to actually hear this at all, and I get it. I get it. I totally get it. All right. I don't want to hear it even. Okay? <laughs> I don't want to hear it. But hear me out. Sonny Boy cannot touch our team. He cannot be anywhere near our team. In the future. If we are battling Pokemon constantly in this game. And we are constantly getting, you know, just like we're, our, our regular good Pokemon are getting destroyed. We genuinely need to reassess Hex time. You know what I mean? We genuinely need to reassess. And that's not... And I know... I, I love... You love him. I love him. Jesus Christ, I did nothing. <laughs> I love him. You love him. We all love him. Um, He's gonna wake up now. I love him. You love him. We all love uh, Sonny... Sonny boy. Right? He's gonna wake up now. Has to wake up now, right? But that's probably he's gonna wake up and I'm not gonna know. Yes, what I'm talking about. If this was D&D, you would have to wait a turn to have a move after you wake up. You get what I'm saying? You'd have to wait a bit. There's no way of knowing if they're gonna wake up. Yeah, this is this is a no go. Like I love Sonny Boy. And it's not just Sonny Boy, like, we just need to, like, reassess everything. Split your lungs on blood and thought. Oh my god, no, you're joking me. You're joking me. Now it's gonna do Ivy Cudgel, go first, buy Ivy Cudgel so fast. This is a- this is a little frustrating. I think it's just because, like, again, this boss battle is hard. Now, f five will go- Twice? Twice in a row? Yeah, use your Ivy Cudgel. Use your Ivy Cudgel. You want Kieran? Do you want Ogre Pond? <laughs> Do you want him? Okay. That would- You know what? I can- I can be frustrated all I want, but I, the only thing I can blame is me making a crappy team. That's it. That's all I can blame. Could you just put me, book up, put, put me back up here, though? Like- Oh my god. I, again, the one, like, the reason why, again, for, for, first of all, I want to make it clear. I made a bad team. I made a bad team with bad decisions. That's what happened here, right? I want to make that perfectly, honestly, openly clear that I made a, a team. Okay, Nurse Joy, thank you so much. Um, I made a bad team here. <laughs> That's what happened. Um, Sonny Boy, we love you, but it's not happening. Get off the team. Uh, Sora, back on the team. Replace with Harp replace Harpo. Uh, Kubo, you can stay on the team. Shadow Realm needs to be on the team. Higher defense. Like, really, just fairy type as well. Um, should we put Snorlax on the team? Like, the, the HP is pretty crazy and the defense is pretty crazy. I think we should put Snorlax on the team in lieu of... Who? In lieu of who? Who could we put on the team instead of Snorlax? Fivel's really good. Shadow Realm is pretty good, too. 
Toto Kubo? We could put him on set instead of Kubo. And actually, hear me out. Do we have any fighting moves we could teach to our, our boy? Hold on a second. Like, do we have Brick Break that we can teach to our, our, our boy Snorlax? Snorlax has a lot of health. That's the reason I'm putting him on here. Snorlax has a... So we have Vacuum Wave. But he can't learn that anyway. Is there any other... Let's, let's check the TM machine and see if he can learn any fighting moves. Oh, really? Is this a variety? That's so cool. I want a TM made. Where's the fighting types, Mom? Mom? Where's Brick... We, can, we can't make Brick Break. Even though he can learn Brick Break. Can we make anything else? We can make Low Kick. But he can't learn Low Kick because he's too big. Brick Break would have been perfect. We need Crabal or Shell. Can we buy some items? Yeah, we can. I want to exchange materials for LP. I want to filter... Wait, what? Wait, hold on a second. That's not what we want to do. We want to get... You should be able to exchange, exchange LP for... Fi oh, God. We're not in a good state right now, guys. What's this? He can learn this, but he doesn't have what that is. Timber Watt. Timber Watt. Aura Sphere. We can't make any of these. We can make this, but he can't learn it. He can't learn low sweep or low kick. He can learn brick brick though. I do have enough materials. I do. Look, we're just gonna have to go with this. No, I don't want anything to me it actually. Listen. <laughs> Honestly, the truth of this wait, it's this way, isn't it? The truth of this is, right? We made a bad team. I don't know what I was thinking putting Sonny Boy back on the team, guys. That was like the silliest thing I've ever done in my life. Um, and I've done a lot of silly things. You know who's also very silly? Sonny Boy. Uh, Sonny Boy's not going back on the team, guys. And I hate it. Because I he had a very, very cool story going forward. The only way Sonny Boy could work is if he got him to like level 100, I think. That's the only way Sonny Boy could work. It was, and again, it was fine for a while. But I think the issue is now... Who's first? Who are we putting out first? Sora? Yeah, Sora for, out first. Sora has a good defense as well. Let's try it this way, let's try it that way. Fighting Pokemon. This is the thing that's like really strange, is like how like in, like having us go all the way back up here. You know what I mean? It's like it's like a little thing you could do just to throw the trainer a bone. I guess they also kind of like want you to be in an area where you can go to any place to grind if you wanted to, which just does make sense too. It does make sense. You know what doesn't make sense? Sonny boy. No one battle me on the way up here. I'm done. He said battle him. No, no. I said don't battle me. Get him, guys. So this team... I, I don't know why I'm even pretending that this team could do good. <laughs> Honestly, I, I'm, 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 I trust in my team. But I also don't trust them. No, I, that sounds weird. I, I think that they don't trust themselves enough. Maybe. timber here's the thing right understand what I'm about to do here understand what I'm about to do here right so maybe we can get some items off the timber we catch right hear me out we get some items off the timber we catch we make brick break <laughs> if, if we fail again we can make brick break you know no you're here. For, you're here for one reason and one reason only, Timber. Timber sweat. That's not what we need, though. Again, like, and I know it's like such an annoying thing to be like. If this battle would be easy if the if the Pokemon didn't go first. It's it's true. Like, it's a fact. That this battle would not be easy. This battle would be way easier if the Pokemon went second. Or if if we got to go first a few times. Like, look, like when Five got to hit Thunder those twice, twice that like it was a completely different battle. Like the energy changed even. But the issue is, is that like that's like saying if if you know wishes were fishes, the world would be an ocean. Like this is the this is the place we are now. This is what we've established. Kieran, do you want Ogremon? You can have him.
Let's try our best. So we could use... Should we terrestrialize him into a dragon form? I think terrestrializing Sora might be the best option. Because I don't think it has anything that's powerful against dragon types. But it might have something that's powerful against um, flying types. You know? Now we're pure dragon. Dragging my elbow across your face. Ha <laughs> Fifty. Here we go. Fifty IV cudgels. Now it's gonna do. It's it's my it's it's the new earthquake for me. You know what I mean? It's the new earthquake. How much damage does the first IV cudgel do? Look at you, Doctor Nogapon. No, Carmine. It's Carmine. Don't get your tongue clap for me yet. 128. Literally did a hundred damage. So we could survive this one if we wanted to. Loki. Loki. What? What? <laughs> Where did you get low kick? <laughs> Grassy train, low kick, ivy culture. There's three moves. You better not have anything else up your sleeve. <laughs> Why in the hell? Now we have nothing that's purely effective against uh, this type. What the? Where? Are where did it get low kick from? All of a sudden, this is this happens to every single Pokemon thing I ever do. This happens all the time. Every single time we play a Pokemon battle, like I, I'm serious. Every single time we play Pokemon, we battle a trainer. We figure out what their moves are they're doing, and we go, okay, we can we can stop this. We can stop this, and we change our Pokemon types around. We terrorize someone. We do something like that, and then what happens? Tell me what happens. Then all of a sudden the Pokemon goes, I have 12 more moves. <laughs> you thought this, you thought, you thought. Yeah, use grassy, use grassy train there, girl. Go ahead. Go ahead and do that. Do that right now. Ah, oh, little Massey, go to your, uh, your sleep. Oh, just a pushy, 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 sheepy, sheepy, sheepy boy. Um. F it. F it. We're probably gonna need it for the next DLC, but next DLC we're gonna be we're gonna be having like I'm not taking any chances, guys. We're but we're 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 training up our Pokemon to be like level 52 million. Hex style. Let's go hex style. No. What? <laughs> All of a sudden it wakes up. <laughs> this is really funny though. I like it. I want people to know, right? I'm just having an exciting time. This isn't like me being angry at the game. I think it's hilarious and it's fun, right? It's really fun. Like, I think sometimes people confuse me going like, because I've heard people before going, oh, that must have made you pretty angry. It's like, no, it's like literally like, like so funny <laughs> to me, like that they like have 50 different moves. I'm just very excited as well, man. This is really, it's, the thing is, it's cool that we have a battle that we're getting effed up in. in. It's been a while, it's been a while. It's been a while since I shadow balled you in the freeze. It's been a while. You know what I mean? And I'm like, I, this is the time that I wish I like. There's sometimes where I'm like, I wish I had face cap because I'm like <laughs> shaking in my chair, jumping up and down like on my buttocks, like bopping up and down. I should say, not jumping. You can't jump on your buttocks unless you're like someone who can do that. If you can do that, impressive. It's been a while. So if he, if IG cut, if I, I IG cut, if IG cut, you get it. We're done. Oh, grassy terrain is gone. You should use grassy terrain again. Oh, of course not. When it, when it, when it needs to, it won't. When it needs to not use grassy terrain, it, it will be like, I'm not using grassy terrain. It understands ball. Get out of here, hearth flame mask ogre pawn. Yeah. This is a really cool battle, though. Like, it's a really cool concept. Get out of here and don't come back.
So this is water type, so we have to we have to switch as soon as possible. And who do we switch to? Dale. Come on out, Dale. Okay, who we battling this time? Better not be another legendary like I did last time. I died twice to OD. I have, oh my god! Oh, I have such a good idea. What if we ban Ivy Cudgel from this game? Oh my god, that would be hilarious. Oh, I have a good idea. Oh, you go first again? It's so surprising, man. It's weird, because like Pokemon, like your Pokemon never goes first. Like I could have the fastest Pokemon in the world, and you never go first. What an insane game. I know who will go first. Fival. So do we use now? Do we use discharge because it will go fa is faster? Yeah, I think we use discharge because because it, it will go first and maybe you can paralyze. Of course, Ivy Cudgel. Who would have thought? Hodge. Jesus Christ, man. This is Earthquake all over again with Cynthia. You know what I mean? This is Earthquake all over again. I'll use Grassy Train. That's good. I use Grassy Pain. That's what I'm feeling right now. No. No, it did not evolve. There, use Ivy. Go on then, love. Use Ivy Cudgel there. Use Ivy Cudgel. Oh, it didn't do much, did it? Here, do you want this Pokemon? <laughs> we can swap. I think this team is good. It's just that, like... So it, it imbues, it does it imbue, oh god. <sighs> Bubba, get out there. It's Bubba time. Now Bubba gets to go first, because in this po Pokemon battle, the bigger one goes first. So, um, I'm actually kind of like excited for this because because the, it's the big oh wait oh oh yeah I forgot you have a new move all of a sudden Ooh. so this is like not gonna work because he's gonna use um low kick again so we probably should get to test the theory and bring out like 12 more different types so he can like make up different moves he's using So, Sora, you going to get out there? You okay, Sora? I mean, you could use Air Lace, but like, see, again, like, it's so crazy how, like, this Pokemon is, like, always, like, again, this would not be, and I'm saying this, like, with 100% certainty, this battle would not be as difficult at all, at all. If, if we got to go first a few times for some of the Pokemon, you know what I mean? Um, we probably should use Thunder on Fival, taking the chance to use Thunder on with Fival. But that was very silly of me, I didn't. Um, there's nothing you can do, really. And I love, by the way, I don't mean to insult Ogrepon. I like Ogrepon. Like, it's been a really good story. I'm just having a good time. This ain't gonna work. Because Ivy Cudgel. It 
It's over. So, here's the thing. We're going to take our beaten. And we're going to come back in the next one. Maybe. And try and do it th this way. Maybe we'd like, maybe like, okay, that team variation isn't working, right? That team variation isn't working. That team very, okay, I get it, Nurse Joy. Uh, that team variation isn't work. <laughs> Being rude to Miss Nurse Joy. Um, Bubba's not going to work because Bubba is going to get attacked right away. Ladybird, like we use that for the, because it is like a, What can we use this for? Honestly, keeping to Toto is fine. So Sora is fine. Fievel's more than fine. Fievel is put in the work. Dale is put in the work. I don't. I. Th I do not think that there's a place for Shadow Realm on the team, but I do think there's a possible place on the team for uh, for Summer or Kubo. Kubo, Kubo, Kubo was fine too. So maybe putting Kubo on the team? Fievel, the problem is Fievel has that weakness to, uh, like was getting destroyed as well. Now, hold on a second now. We could put Lionel on the team. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just saying Lionel could come on the team and teach her a thing or two. F Ghost Fire Grass. What is everyone thinking about Lionel? Level 86, Lionel. Level 76, Amora. Who's like a poison type as well, by the way. What Should we try maybe use more poison moves? But I don't like Glamour. Glamour's not going to go on our team for the last bit. But I do like Lionel. Should we probably try put Lionel on the team? What do you guys think about putting Lionel on the team? Who puts a vote? But who do we, who do we place Lionel with? Ladybird? Because of the dark type advantage? Ladybird didn't do well. Why not? Why not? We're getting destroyed. Wait, hold on a second here. We'll try one more time. And if we don't get it, we'll come back next time. And we'll regroup. Because uh, there's no point sitting here, you know... Uh, trying our best on something when, like, it's 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 not going to work out. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's like... Can we evolve this Pokemon? I tell you... Oh, we can rear candy it. I thought we could evolve it that way. Maybe not. Okay, let's head back up again. We'll try one more time. And if this doesn't work out, we'll regroup. We'll regroup. I'll take uh, some advice from you guys as usual. And uh, we'll regroup. Whew. So the first type is always going to be fire. So having Sora out there to start off, I think, is a good idea. Just don't terrorize Sora. you think Ogre Palm would do in this moment when he's standing before me Ivy Cudgel in hand I'm gonna kill this Ivy Cudgel <laughs> the Ivy Cudgel is the new earthquake remember earthquake for the maybe some of you might not remember the Cynthia battle uh, with earthquake I'm totally gonna get comments years later like I do on that battle all the time you just changed out your team 
Or was that the Vola fight? The Vola fight was when I changed out my team for, uh, for like, legendary Pokemon. You just change out your team and use legendaries. So, yeah. <laughs> I did. <laughs> Funny enough that having a good team affects everything. The only reason I'm putting uh, Summer on the team and Kubo on the team... Do we have Summer and Kubo on the team? Maybe just... Uh, we have Kubo on the team. Honestly, having Dale on the team ain't, ain't a bad idea either. Uh, because I think what we should be using with Dale... But then again, Dale's getting destroyed too. What level is Summer? Summer is level... 60... No, no. Dale is a better idea. Dale is a better idea. See, I'm the only reason I'm putting a bug type on the team is because like, we haven't used a bug type to try and do this. But then again, it's, it doesn't matter. Like again, like I said, if this, pa if, the, if this Pokemon didn't go first all the time and didn't have low kick, low kick was like so insulting to me. When they when it used low kick, I was genuinely like, oh my god. <laughs> I never felt more insulted in my life when I saw a move from a Pokemon. I genuinely was like, I want to cry. Yeah, I want to test my strength too. Like when I saw low kick happen, I genuinely was like, I need I need to take a break a little bit. And I didn't take a break, which is not not a good thing. I'm wondering who would be a good idea to terrorize. That's another thing as well. Like, I have all these Pokemon. Try our best to try our best. Yeah, it's a really cool Pokemon, Carmen. Carmen, you're really pretty. Let's go. I'm ready. Time to surf. Time to time to surf. What level is this Pokemon, by the way? Like, what, what level are people getting that, that this Pokemon is? From my perspective, it, it seems like it's like a lot around 80. Man, the fact that like this is a fire terrorcelized type and like my most powerful water move doesn't do anything because he's gonna use Ivy Carmen, he's gonna use Ivy Cudgel. He's Carmine, please, he's gonna use Ivy Cudgel, watch. Ivy Cudgel time. I wanna cry. I wanna cry. Cause now we're gonna get destroyed again. Now I gotta do math. Now I gotta do math. So how much damage did it? Two hundred thirty-eight minus one hundred thirty-one. That's that's too much math. Hundred. He did one hundred and seven damage to me. So we could still survive this next battle, unless they decide arbitrarily that like all of a sudden Ivy Cudgel does more damage, which they might. They didn't. Thank the thank thank you, a god of Pokemon above. Okay, there we go. First one down without losing a Pokemon. This is a good sign. I'm sorry for shouting into the mic, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for shouting into the mic this episode. I can see it on the the, the audio values. I feel terrible. I try to normalize the volume as much as I can, so hopefully it never sounds too bad. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, you're gonna be, you're gonna be, you're gonna be a big, big water boy now. I think we have to let Sora die, because we waste a move if we let Sora live, right? So what's the best thing to send against the water type? Is well, sending out Fivel first of all. I think to use Thunder as much as possible is a good idea. Uh, but I'm still gonna use Fuller Sora on uh, on our boy Sora. Like, I, like, I don't think letting him die is the, what I want to do. We're going to do as much damage as humanly possible before we let Sora die. Oh my god, yeah, use low kick all you want, buddy. <laughs> use low kick all you want. Oh, it's going to use Ivy Cudgel. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's go. Oh yeah, let Sora do this. That, let's not let Sora die. Full restore Sora. Let's not, don't let Sora die. Come on, Sora, you can do this. 
Get this Pokemon, Sora. Kill this Pokemon. Murder this Pokemon, Sora. No, we want Ogre Pond. Ogre Pond's definitely going on the team. What do you guys think about Ogre Pond going on the team? I think so. I think it's a good idea. Oh, maybe he'll use Grassy Terrain again. Yes, and it gives us two free moves. What a game. <laughs> what a game, guys. What a game. Let's go. Uh, what's the next move? Yeah, so it's gonna use like Ivy Cudgel on us. It's gonna knock the shit out of us. But still, oh my god, this is a whole different battle. What the hell? So all I, so you're telling me? Hold on a sec. You're telling me that this whole time, that this whole time, I was just doing the battle wrong. <laughs> Yeah, like, honestly, Sora, well done. Sorry for sniffling, guys, by the way. There we go. Okay, 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 so there's hope. There's hope, everyone. There's hope. So we could use Surf on this Pokemon now. What do you think about using Surf? Or maybe fully healing right away and seeing how damage, much damage it does anyway? Yeah, full restore on Sora. This is actually like the, the best we've ever done. <laughs> we've never done better. Right? We've never done better than this, and we never will again. This is our best chance. Yeah, okay. It was bound to happen at some point. You know what I mean? It was bound to happen. What Pokemon do we use against this Pokemon now, though? Um, honestly, having Shadow Realm would have been perfect here, actually. So, Energy Ball. Oh. Oh. Have you met my Pokemon? He's been with us since the beginning. <laughs> He's been with us since the start. <laughs> He's a watch this. He's gonna destroy him with one hit. Watch this now. Watch this. <laughs> oh lordy Lou. Oh lordy Lou. Uh, what's super effective? See, the problem is, Sora was doing so good, so we know that, that we can use Sora to do this. We know that we can use Sora to do this. Uh, what, does, what is our terrorized form? It's Bug. So I have no problem terrorizing. No, because it's Rock. Right? Oh, Grassy Train, go, 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 we're gonna Brick Break. You ready? You ready for Brick Break? You ready? 95 accuracy, let's go. 95 accuracy, let's go. Oh, right there in the face, that's what happened. Right there in the face, cornerstone. Okay, don't use another move. Oh no, no Ivy Cudgel banned. Banned from this, uh, t from the TCG. Okay, brick break time, brick break time. Brick break time. Brick break time. I have my HP restored too. I'm gonna do something crazy here. I'm gonna let Grassy Terrain uh, run out. No, it's not gonna run out. What am I on about? Okay, unless he uses like low kick randomly. How many Ivy Cudgels do you, How much PP does Ivy Cudgel have? Can someone answer that question? You and the. You there, answer that question. I don't know, but that's fine. You go about your business then. How much PP does uh, Ivy Cudgel have? How much PP 
does Ivy Cudgel have? It says how much it's it looked up how much PP Cajun Cudgel has. I don't that's not <laughs> Carstone. Ah. I'm so excited guys. This is, this is such a good work. Because I think it's going to go turn into its normal self after this, right? Oh look, it's Ivy Cudgelin again. Who would have thought? What a surprise. What a game. Who would have thought? Really, this ain't going to work. You know what I mean? There we go. Okay, so we... Okay, we're, gonna, we're probably going to kill us. We have to hope that he doesn't use, that he uses, does grassy train again. No, of course. Of course. No. Breaks the pattern whenever it needs to. You know what I mean? As always in this game. It's okay, Kubo. You did really good. You did really good, because now we're going to send out... Dale. Dale, 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 Dale's here. Poison Jab? That could be faster. I think Poison Jab is actually very fast. Stop! Stop! Right now! Why is... Mom! Mommy! Mother! Mother, please, mother. Please, mother. Please. So thunder is very fast, so I think we use thunder. Oh, this could work. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Okay, it definitely is going to use its grass form now because it has four masks. Ravens are power from long ago. Oh, that's actually really sweet. Oh my god, here we go. Final battle. Final battle. We're gonna use Thunder again because it's fast and like, you know, why not? But I really feel like we don't we're not gonna do this, guys. We have a fire type, but that's not gonna mean anything. Not very effective. It's not very effective. Honestly? I think we terror slice Toto next time. That's my opinion. I think we terror I think we save the terrorization for Toto. And we hope Thunder works. So at least it does some damage, you know what I mean? Not very effective, but like chip a chip a chip chippy chippy. Oh my god, it's paralyzed! No way! Oh my god, if we could do this. If we could do this, Thunder again? Oh my god, if we could do this. Oh my god! Come on. Oh my god, is it paralyzed and not able to move? Is it paralyzed and not able to move? Oh my god, Thunder again. Oh my god. Five- No, Fival! I should've used Discharge. I was too greedy. I was too greedy. It's gonna use Ivy Cudgel now. It's gonna destroy me with Ivy Cudgel. Oh my god. My heart, my heart, my heart's pounding, my heart's pounding, my heart's pounding, my heart's pounding, my heart's pounded. My heart's pounded. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, Toto, get out there. We're gonna do a Terra Slice Torch song. Who's up? Who's with me? Who's with me? Let me hear your voices. Check status of Toto. His Terra Slice is fire, so that's a good idea, right? Super effective Torch Song. Let's go. Let's go, please, 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 please. I've been good. I've been good. I've been good. I've been good. I've been a good boy, maybe. Please, 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 please. Okay, okay, Torch Song starting off. Okay, this isn't a bad sign. Oh! 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 Oh no, 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 this could be it! This could be it! Just! <laughs> oh my god, yes! Yes. Toto, I'm sorry I ever doubted you or ever didn't use you. You should have been in this DLC the whole time. Oh my god, Toto, yes! Oh. Duh. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> sorry guys again for being so loud. Catch.
We should be able to catch it, right? We should just be able to catch it. <laughs> yes! That felt good. That felt good. Whew. Ogre Pond. This mischief-loving Pokemon is full of curiosity. It battles by drawing out the, the type-based energy contained within its masks. Would you like to give Ogre Pond a nickname? No, I think Ogre Pond stays as Ogre Pond. Ogre Pond's a great name. So Ogre Pond's a grass type? What type? What level is Ogre Pond? So, Dale. Yeah. <laughs> so what level is Ogre Pond, I wonder? Oh my god, Fresendipity evolves into Ogre Pond. That's crazy. Ogre Pond entrusted you with the Cornerstone Mask, Wellspring Mask, and the Heart Flame Mask. You put the mask in your bag, other items in, in your pocket. Oh god. Oh my god. That was awesome. Well done, Water. That was pretty uh, impressive. Congratulations. I'll take good care of it, Kieran. I'll take good care of it. Yeah. Why can't I be like you, Wonder? This is so sad. And he doesn't have to, you know, talk about his feelings. I hate when he gets like that. Girl, we need to learn a lesson here. Don't worry about him. I will worry about him. He's the one who said the winner gets to become Ogapon's partner. Yeah, but he's still sad. <laughs> Come on, let's head home. Head home, girl. I love you. But like I'm I am worried about Kieran's feelings. Oh, there's told by Andrew. Hey, good wonder, good morning. I got a message from Carmen. She says she's waiting for you at the Loyalty Plaza and that you should show up and meet her there. Say, why do you always use me as your messenger boy? Oh, dude, you've been used as a messenger boy like once. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where's he gone? Where'd that guy go, teacher? You're not gonna fight him, are you? I mean, I'm gonna fight him. Where is he? Just jump on him right away. Your life is forfeit. Where is the Loisley Plaza? It's over here. Oh, it's up there. Yeah, we know this is where this is. Sora, get him. Boom. <laughs> Sora destroys him. So let's see. We have a... What level is uh, Ogre Pond? 70. So, I, so I, he actually wasn't that high of a level. But now we have Ogre Pond with us. Look at that. Oh my god. Let's go, Ogre Pond. Actually, let's put him back in the ball. We don't want to upset... Uh, here in too much. I think we just fly up here. This is the first place where me and Kieran had a little mission together. And that's where they also like came out of the ground. There you are. Took your time. You really battled great yesterday, Wonder. I guess the Master Chief Squad has completed its mission. Though, Akiki. Well, he showed himself his rumors since he got home yesterday. That's worrying. Yeah. But you don't need to feel guilty or anything, Wonder. It all started because uh, I said we should keep the whole Ogrepan thing a secret. Yeah, true. And you wouldn't think about Kiki's got a bit of an ego too. He doesn't take losing well. I don't think it's an ego, man. Like it, it doesn't seem it doesn't seem like ego to me. I think it's the opposite. I think it's like he doesn't he doubts himself so much that he wants to be able to like get better. And he's trying to prove himself. I think he's a lot of self doubt. How's Ogre Pond doing? I'll be honest, I've grown real fond of Ogre Pond myself. Guess Kiki's rubbed off on me a bit. Do you think you let me have a battle with Ogre Pond? Girl. I love you. But we are lit like we literally had twelve different battles just now. Like, we're tired. I knew you see us. You're not one to turn down a good battle. Let me know when you're ready. Like, what is... Like, in what world? Like, is... Would you... After seeing us having a big battle yesterday, go, can I battle you? In what universe do you think this is okay? Let's go.
Yeah, let's go. Let's get to our positions. I mean, it's cool that we're battling Carmine again, because she destroyed us once before as well. But I do think that there is kind of this thing where it's like, man, like... We've... we've <laughs> we just had, like, one of the toughest battles ever. I don't think we need to, uh, you know... You may wake up here for this, you know, you better make it over time. You asked me to come here, Carmine! Oh, look what it is. If it isn't a low kick... Okay, when I do it, it's cool. <laughs> when I do it, it's the coolest move ever. You should really hear where it hurts, don't you? I bet you're real popular back home. Not really. Actually, we have good, some good friends, but I won't call it popular. We're very- we have, we, we have good friends, is what I'd say. I wonder, can you terrorize or do you have to put a different mask on him each time? Nine tails. Yes, we will switch Pokemon. Oh, we don't have a, a full-on team here. Like, we don't have a team that, like, is set, like, even, like, Lionel shouldn't be on the team. <laughs> Lionel's not a member of the team. No offense to Lionel. Not a member of the team. Extra sensory. Is this she's doing that thing with nine tails? Don't no 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 no. That's so silly, man. The like the one move. It's like oh yeah, that one move you can use to beat me. I disable it. There you go. Carmen, was that worth it? More Pico. Which one, which one could be more Pico? Uh, Toto, get out there. Level 80, Toto, get out there. And like then we have special attack rises as well, which means the next attack is gonna be just as powerful as Flamethrower. Oh god. Of course. The usual thing in this game I know like that Pokemon always had that move. You know what I mean? I can't use my usual but they do, Pokemon do, do do that in this game where they have like, all of a sudden they have the random move that is powerful against your Pokemon. I don't care about your changing. Believe it or not. <laughs> Believe it or not. I don't care. You're a little mouse thing, right? Do you want to meet the cutest mouse thing? It's called Fival. Right? And this is called Dazzling Gleam. No, 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 no. Don't. You dare. <laughs> Stop right now. I'm telling you. Stop. Livani, that's not even a real Pokemon. You know? I think sometimes we need to get... We need to talk to the, 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 the portrayers in this game and say, you're not using a real Pokemon. What is Livani? This is Kubo. Nice to meet you. What's Livani? That's... We should have used a, a fire type. You know what? Did you ever hear Brick Brick? Yeah, that's what I thought, Levi. Really cool Pokemon, though. Unbelievably cool Pokemon. Like, actually, like, actually a very cool Pokemon. Maybe try Megahorn? Like, I'm genuinely impressed with the design of this Pokemon. It looks really cool. Critical hit. Just called Megahorn. Watch you think? Yeah, I like that Pokemon a lot. 
Oh, whoa. <laughs> He's about to send Sinistia. Sinistia was which which one was Sinistia? I don't know which one Sinistia was. But Lionel, you're here, get in there. Yeah, okay, Sinistia. It's a ghost type, so we're gonna get destroyed by Hex. But if we can use Heat Wave effectively... What did you do? What did it do? What did it, what did it do there? Because I didn't know what it did. Oh, that uh, critical hit came out of nowhere. I could have sworn it was gonna be a regular hit. Same, to be honest. Carmen, I don't even think about critical hits once in my life. Um, Polter Poltergeist? Maybe this goes first? No, we're gonna die. Lionel, I put you on the team because you were overpowered. We have to have a... Okay, we're gonna have to have a HR meeting with Lionel later. Lionel, you see... We love you. We love... Oh, don't we? We love him. We love him. Yeah, it's nothing to do with your work performance. Alright? But sometimes... <laughs> sometimes... You're just not... Up to scratch. I do my work on time. Yeah, no, we know you do. We know you do your work on time. I was out of this very late, so I don't really have a really good understanding of the team. Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. But we're going to have to let you go today. Your sissy's strong, too. I'm sorry. Lionel. But I got a family. <laughs> yeah, you do. Well, you did. The family here at Calvin's Pokemon Team and Company. I lost, but I'm also not surprised. You really, you and Ogapon really do get along, don't you? It's almost making me jealous. Ogapon's my new main. Pon Pon. Pon Pon. Actually, uh, sorry to tell you, but I... Wait. Oh, I thought it was going to be Cassiopeia for a second. <laughs> hey, well, this is Briar. It seems all students' uh, pairs have completed their orienteering as of this morning. The caretaker wanted to have some words so you could come back to the community center. So we're finished? Message sheet loud and clear. As Karma Uchi, wonderful. That's one less phone call I have to make. You kids never cease to amaze me. It seems we become uh, fast friends the moment you spend even the briefest amount of time together. We'll head on to the community center. I'll be uh, with the rest of the students. I don't really want to, but I guess I can I can play nice uh one last time. So we have to head back to the, the center. We actually like like dude like our team is good. It's just that like that was supposed to be a, a final boss. That the ogre pawn. You know what I mean? Like, we can't sit here and deny that I wasn't supposed to be a final boss, you know? Wait, is this a send-off? Are we leaving? I have see most of it here anyway. Now then, the character got some worthless. I was giving, giving him our full attention. Oh, nice. Actually very nice. Truth be told, I didn't think you'd wrap up the toys as quickly. You're quite the prodigies. A visit from Brazil still have heaps of time left to enjoy Kitami Hall has to offer. Continue to make yourself at home and explore as you please. However, I'm sorry for suddenly springing this on you, but Karam and Kieran and I will need to return to Blueberry Academy a little early. Oh no. Again, truly sorry, but the, there has been some developments concerning the Great Crater. I'm afraid we must be heading back. I realize that I was here as your chaperone, but you kids have all proven to be very capable. I'm sure you'll be fine without me. Thank you so much for looking after them in my stead. Don't mention it. You can lead these kids to me. 
No, no, Carmen, I believe you had something you wanted to say. Yes. Unfortunately, my brother's not feeling well, so I... Oh, what? He's not going to say goodbye? Anyways, you all know this village is where I was born. I'll be honest, I didn't want any outsiders coming here at all. <laughs> it felt like I was being turned into a tourist trap for a bunch of ignorant strangers. But then we spent some time together, and none of you were the way I imagined you'd be at all. You're really nice, and I actually talked to you. I shouldn't have been so quick to judge people I didn't know anything about. So I guess what I'm trying to say is I had fun. Thank you so much for visiting our village. Especially you, Wander. The rest of these guys suck. I agree. I'm glad you came to visit. I mean, it's not like this is a goodbye forever. Hopefully not. <laughs> I didn't get to say goodbye to Kieran. Blueberry Academy has tons of strong traders. You better come visit soon. We are going to Blueberry Academy, so that's going to be fun. So we might be see we will see them again. Oh, I almost forgot. I sent you to get packed and everything. Oh, Kieran's not saying goodbye? It's not goodbye, okay? We're definitely going to see each other again. Hopefully. Hopefully. Oh, good boy, Wonder. Wait, but she's not here. That's kind for you. I suppose you never know uh, quite what to expect from her. She was great, but she just needs. She has a lot of growing up to do as well. I think we all do. Each moment spent with your kids just dazzling for an adult like me. It's almost blinding. Anyway, that was the rest of the school trip. Let's all give our caretaker a big thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. That was great. I need to become... <gasps> oh, I need to become a lot stronger. Uh-oh. Stronger, stronger, and stronger, and stronger. So this is, I think they're doing a... Uh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no, they're doing a cliffhanger for the Blueberry Academy DLC. What? Kieran, just you wait, Wonder. Wait, what? <laughs> That's how you do it. That's a cliffhanger right there. I, I'm, I, I, I. So we're gonna see Kieran again for the next DLC. Actually, terrified of that aspect because I don't know what he's gonna become. I'm terrified. I'm genuinely terrified. So we should just travel back to uh, our town then I guess and I think we're going to pick I think we're going to pick our team based on just power this time guys because I feel like you know we don't want to mess up again like and have a terrible team there oh look it's like lashing out holy hell guys thank you so much to everyone who has uh, been supporting this series oh my god it's really raining uh, they never paid the baby gangs this year Ty Fire 2 Jamie Bull Janet the Banana Normal Cow Rachel S the Ghost of Nazuma Felicious Felix George Candelaria Escon Yule Radish Poker Girl Tether and fruity. We have a cliffhanger right now for our boy. And I'm actually extremely terrified. Extremely terrified. Um, worried, in fact. I can't... I'm, I'm gonna miss these characters quite a bit, but the fact that I guess we're gonna see them next time, but it might be in a different form, is even more terrifying than anything I could imagine. Um, I'm super, super worried about, <laughs> about <laughs> what Kieran is doing. He swept back his hair? Oh, God. <laughs>